What's up guys, it's James again, and today I have been waiting a very long time for this to happen, but we finally have a trailer for The Matrix 4 Resurrections. Now, before we begin, very brief history with me and The Matrix. Um, it has been my second favorite movie of all time, the first Matrix film, second to Mortal Kombat, and you know, I've played all the games, I've watched the Animatrix, I've watched all the movies, I even played The Matrix online way back in the day. And, uh, you know, so the extended lore of the Matrix is something I'm very familiar with and also like theories and stuff like that. So, you know, when I heard that um, at least one of the Wachowskis was coming back to make the fourth film, super excited to see where they go. So, yeah, uh, I don't know what to expect. I've stayed away from spoilers and apologies if you hear background noise. My neighbor downstairs won't stop talking. And uh, yeah, so let's let's take a look here. The Matrix 4. And here we go. Thomas? Ah, oh, the black cat. You're particularly triggered right now. Can you tell me what happened? I've had dreams that weren't just dreams. Okay. So it looks like Neo as a program in the Mind Matrix, maybe? Crazy. We don't use that word in here. Okay. For a while, we thought that Neo and Trinity might be programs in the Matrix. Hi. Aha! Carrie Ann Moss. Have we met? Okay, alright. One pill makes you larger, and one pill makes you small. Okay, I can already see the philosophical side coming out a little bit. Bunch of blue pills, very symbolic between the blue pill and the red pill. All right, we got the mirror. Yeah. Time to fly. Nice. So that's a younger Morpheus, or just a recast? You're going to have to fly me. The only thing that matters to you is still here. I know it's why you're still fighting. And why you will never give up. You don't know me. No? So, is it possible that... I mean, if it's within the same universe of the original films... Is Morpheus now connecting with Neo as a program in the Matrix? Or is it is it a different Morpheus, maybe? There's the uh, going back to where the building started. jump we all saw the the photos of the Matrix. All right, all right. I have high hopes. Resurrections. All right. Cool. Can't wait. All right. So yeah, that's uh, that's the trailer. Trailer 1, so I'm assuming that, because uh, it says official trailer 1 on the main YouTube channel for WB, I'm assuming that there might be a next trailer, you know, closer to the release of it. But yeah, so far, it looks like a Matrix film, I'll give it that. I mean, obviously, it's been years and years, and, um, you know, despite uh, Lana Wachowski coming back, uh, you know, the rest of the team may be different, like, you know, John Gata is probably... I, I hope John Gate is on the project. That'd be really cool. Um, he did the um, the special effects for the first film, and I'm not sure if he did the second and third. Uh, but then he did Speed Racer after, and that's a whole different <laughs> that's a whole different conversation. But um, yeah, so I'm assuming that the story probably follows some of the theories that were out there about Neo and Trinity being programs now after uh, Revolutions finished up. You know, like or it could be the next iteration of the one. Who knows? Or, you know, since Morpheus looks a lot younger, I 
I don't want to say it's a prequel, especially since the title is Resurrections. Uh, if it was a prequel, that would be kind of a weird... Um, that would be kind of weird. Like, it's before Trinity got pulled out and... You know, maybe something like that. I have no idea. I'm, I'm going to assume it's after the uh, the third film. And now this is Neo as a program in the Matrix, um, you know, being uh, kind of rediscovering himself. But we did see the body of Neo inside the, um, the you know, the farms that the, the machines have of humans. Um, unless that's a flashback. Who knows? But anyway, yeah, so that's my reaction. I'm looking forward to it. You know, as a big Matrix fan, I'm happy to see more movies happen. Um, and I'll try to keep my biasness aside. Like, I'm not trying to say this is going to be the greatest thing ever. But I have high hopes. You know, I hope it's good. And uh, yeah, so that's my reaction. And as always, thanks for watching.